For, for me, it's crystal clear. We, we have to look at, at NATO. Because, because in the end, you could, focus on, on, you could not focus on only one country. You have to take care of the whole region. And therefore, NATO planning. And based on that, also NATO demands with regard to troops are vital. So as you might be aware, Germany is ready to send more troops, to spend troops to NATO for this purpose. <laughs> It's absolutely clear that the collective defense, based on the development of the security situation in the East, uh, will be the main effort also for the German armed forces. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the expectations are very high and this is understandable as understandable having in mind what is going on in Ukraine and uh, how big are the threats uh, for the Baltic and region and for, for the eastern flank of NATO. So uh, we expect that, first of all, there will be very clear and strong uh, conclusions text on the threats, on the, lo uh, on the Russia as a long threat uh, for the security of NATO allies, and not no, only NATO allies, but also other countries which are surrounding uh, neighboring uh, Russia. Uh, on the other hand, we need very concrete decisions regarding re the reinforcement you mentioned. And uh, actually, I think one of the most important elements of this text should be turning the battle group's battalions into brigades. highly need to switch from air policing regime to air defense regime and all the decisions technical political uh, decisions should be done because the dominance in the airspace is extremely important having in mind the experience of of the war in uh, ukraine